Hello guys, welcome to Cloud Master Classes. My name is Lokesh Majan. So let's get started. In this video, I will be installing MySQL Server to our virtual machine that we have created in our previous video. If you have not watched our previous video, then do check that out. Link is given in the description box. In that video, I have explained what is virtual machine and how to create and connect to a virtual machine in Azure. So without wasting our time, let's get started. As you can see here, I am already logged in my Azure account. So now I will create a virtual machine and connect to it and then I will install MySQL Server. So to create a virtual machine, we will directly click on virtual machine. And here I will click on create virtual machine. So here I will give the resource group name. Uh, I will create new and give it a name as compute. Then I will give virtual my virtual machine a name. I will give it test VM. The region will be East US. We will keep the remaining stuff as same. Uh, and here we will do for SSH public key source, we will do generate new key pair. And then we will click on review and create button. We'll quick, quickly create a virtual machine. It will take some time. So as you can see, all my validations are passed here. We will click on create button. And we will download our private key and create resources. So as you can see, our test VM key is already downloaded. And here, as you can see, our deployment is in progress. You can also check it in the notification bar. Here you can see deployment is in progress. So our virtual machine is deploying to East US region. It will take few minutes. We'll wait for some time. So as you can see here, uh, it is showing your deployment is complete. And in notification bar, it is showing deployment succeed, which means that we have successfully deployed our virtual machine to East US region. I am creating this virtual machine quickly as I have already explained all the steps in depth in our previous video. So now I will click on go to resources. And as you can see, now we can connect, restart, stop, capture, delete our virtual machine. And this is our public IP address that we got. And for private key, we have already downloaded it here. And now I will click on connect through SSH because this is an Ubuntu machine. And now it is giving me all the steps to connect, uh, how to connect to our virtual machine. So Azure provides us Cloud Shell through which we can connect to our VM. So to use Cloud Shell, we need to click on this Cloud Shell. Once we click on this, our Azure Cloud Shell will open. So as you can see, we are connected to our Cloud Shell. And now we need to just follow the steps. So now, first of all, we need to upload our private key. To this cloud shell for that we will click on this icon and click on upload so as you can see here is our private key I will upload it to cloud shell and you can see here that our file is uploaded it's showing me complete message we'll close this and to make sure that it is uploaded successfully I will click on ls I will type the command ls and as you can see here that our file is uploaded here successfully so now 
I will just follow these steps. It's saying ensure you have read only access to private key. So we will just copy this command, paste it over here and just change the file name to our file name. I will copy it, paste it over here and this is done. Uh, we can check this also by typing ls minus ltrh so as you can see here we have read only access to our file so now we just need to provide a path to our ssh private key so for the path we will type this command pwd and this is our path where our private key is so now I will just copy this command, paste it over here and now I will change the private key path to our path. I'll just copy paste it, paste it over here and now I will give the file name which is our test vm key 1 I will copy it paste it over here and then click on enter so it is asking me the confirmation whether I want to establish the connection or not so I will put yes and as you can see we have successfully connected to our virtual machine this step is already done our in our previous video but I have quickly created it and now what we have to do we have to install MySQL server to our virtual machine we are already in our virtual machine uh, you can check it by clicking or by typing host name and this is a, we are in test VM so now what I will do I will quickly install MySQL server to our virtual machine so to install MySQL server we will type in some simple commands that is sudo apt get update and now we will type sudo apt get install mysql server so it is asking me whether i want to install it or not so we'll continue with yes and it's installing on my virtual machine as you can see here will take some time so it will take some time So now you can see that MySQL server is installed in our virtual machine. We can check it by typing MySQL underscore V. So as you can see, we have MySQL version 14.14, which is installed in our Linux machine. So that's all for now. I hope you liked the video and you can also install different tools and software on your virtual machine. You can play around with it. So that's all for now. And one suggestion as you are using Azure free subscription, so you can go to your test VM and once you complete all your tasks, you can click on stop button. It will ask you to stop your VM so you can click on OK.
this will stop your virtual machine so as you can see here also connection closed for this public IP and this will help you to save your cost as you have only $200 credit and that's why we are just creating it learning it and then we are stopping our virtual machine so in the notification section you can see that stopping virtual machine and the status is showing deallocating so now here you can see status is stopped and in notifications section it is saying successfully stopped virtual machine so this will help you to save some of your cost so that's all that is just a suggestion for you thank you for now and if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment section that's all for now if you like our video do like share and subscribe our channel thank you